everyone and welcome back to my channel so this uh, today we are watching a different section of heroes united so this production was released in 2013 so Skull and Taskmasters strategize a plan to get rid of Captain America by stealing the weapons that belong to Iron Man. I don't see how getting rid of. Let me rephrase it. I don't see how stealing the weapons belonging to Iron Man will get rid of Captain America. But anyway, so after the two heroes training was complete, the Hydra soldiers infiltrated the heli carrier and headed towards the weapons vault and during their attack two other soldiers went in and escaped with the stuck repulsor cannon iron man flies to reclaim his repulsor cannon while cap fights with taskmaster but no avail as taskmaster takes him down and kidnap him to the base which Skull stole Cap's superhuman blood to create an army replicate <laughs> I'm sorry replicated with the same powers as he has but I don't get it it's like he just what has um if I remember they injected I forgot what kind of serum into him that made him not bulky but like like become a super soldier like um Bucky was but he don't really have a lot of super strength though. So anyway, arriving in Antarctica, two of the Avengers witnessed a giant rocket containing Cap's blood enough to turn everyone in the world into a super-powered army, an underground facility that, where they mass produce Stark's repulsor cannon and copy Cap's shield from the real one. Dude, you cannot copy the shield because like if you remember from the I forgot which movie, I think the first one they said that it's the only like shield that can like be made. So the superhuman Hydra soldiers arrive to defeat the two Avengers before they can finish them off, Hulk arrives to their aid assistance. Iron Man fights against Iron Master with Hulk and one while Cap goes to confront Red Skull and to hold the rocket's launch sequence. Cap succeeds in stopping the rocket by stuck by sticking his shield into the fuel tank causing the rocket to disrupt by the launch and destroying the whole facility in the process. Red Skull, Iron Master and the Re remaining Hydra soldiers survived and escaped but taken into custody by shield at the heli carrier Iron Man Cap and Hulk begins training and ends up with the two being beaten by Iron Patriot heat seeking missiles after the two make up they and Hulk went went out to eat wait a second i didn't say go in combat you can't always be the one who says go that's your problem stark you never strategize you just wing it it's called thinking on your feet or in my case boot chance i adapt to the unexpected by being unpredictable